Hi, welcome to Aquaglow training video. Today we're going to show you how to set up your brand new machine and how to use it without any worries. My name is Barbara and I am the head trainer here at Cyberedic Wellness USA. This is prop one, uh, the setup of the machine. So basically when you receive your package, uh, you have a very big box with the Aquaglow machine on the bottom. And on top, you have another box, including all of your accessories. So I'm going to show you how to unpack what's included and how to set it up. So I would recommend to start with the Aquaglo machine. You can see in the back all the different um, holes and where you're going to connect all the power cords and the waste container. And then on the top here, you have three little holes for your uh, solution bottles to uh, have your tips and uh, anything that you may need during your facial. Uh, once you open your accessory box, you will notice first the handpiece. And if it's not your first machine, you'll notice that we have a brand new handpiece setting, a different cord. Uh, if you compare to the older version of the machine, it was a black cord and that was already set up and incorporated in the machine. Uh, this time around, you have to connect your uh, cord in the back and it's going to be connected to that white little plug here. So all you have to do is just insert and you are set up. You have a holder on the side, you can just rest it there. Then you have a little plastic bag that includes different caps, extra caps, 20 clear treatment tips. Those are your one size only patented tip. Uh, so this is one size fits all. There's no small or bigger size. We only have one size treatment tip and it's the clear one. It's a non-abrasive and it's a dome tip. The second type of tip you have is your cleaning tip. You have two of them included with your starter package. This is your sealed cleaning tip. So this one can never be used for a treatment. I would recommend to have it set up on the side and you will only use this to maintain, flush out the system and cleans your machine. The treatment tips, you can just take one and place it on the handpiece right away. Just secure it. No need to twist it or anything, just place it on the handpiece and you're ready to go. Then you have your cryo handpiece. Okay. The cryo handpiece holder. So all you have to do for this will be to use a screwdriver and kind of remove those little screws and then just insert back in. And then when it's done, you will see what it looks like here. Okay. It's just to be set up on the side to hold your cryo handpiece like this. Then you have your connector for your cryo handpiece. Okay, regular cord. So the small end will go the tip of the cryo handpiece. And then the back, you have something to secure in the back of the machine right in that little silver pin here. So all you have to do is match and then twist it to secure it. And then you have your power cord. So that's for the main power. And same thing you have in the back 
just plug it in the back. You have your empty bottle. That's for the cleaning process. And then it's also included two bottles of the S3 and four bottles of your S1. This is included with the system and when you reorder, the solutions will look like so. The Aquaporin brand. Okay, so when you reorder, the solutions will be clear bottles. But initially in your package, you get some that have a label on it. And then finally, you have your waste container. Very important to set it right to prevent a lack of suction. Always double check here the O ring, the little seal, because this can come off. Okay, it can come off anytime during a treatment. So, very important to make sure it's secured. And then you have this in the back that it's going to help you to insert right in the back of the machine. So it will insert right here and stay into place. Okay. And then this, you want to put it on the opposite side, the handle, just go all the way in and secure. Then you're ready to insert. And then you can take those tubes. This one goes into in lid. And then this one can go where it says out. And then if you wanted to go and take your solutions, we'll take the example here. One solution, another solution, and then usually we put S1 on this side where the green button is and S3 on the orange side. When you use the S2, you can use it on either side. You have those little tubing with the cap. Just insert in, secure, and connect to those little tiny connector here and do the same thing on the other side and then you have an extra one connect this one too to the s1 it has also numbers so you can't be making any mistake and now everything is ready to go the switch to turn on your machine is in the back, on and off. Uh, for the cryo handpiece, this is a little silver button here, on and off also. On the side here, you have the pressure to adjust the suction mode all the way from zero to 10. And on this side here, you have your flow and it's all the way minus two plus, very easy. You can close or open your flow. So that's how much solution you want to be released during the treatment. And that's all you need to know about the setup of your machine.